Hello students, today we are going to discuss about program media and its applications. In this video, we will discuss about program media, characteristics of program media, uses of program media and types of program media. Program media includes all the activities like games, singing, arts and crafts, storytelling, street plays and other theatre activities. These are purposefully organized by the workers in the group to generate interacting among members and to accomplish the set objectives. In a true sense, we can say that the program makes the group. Program influences members in two ways. First, it enhances participation and the other is it improves interaction with other members and with the group worker. Let's discuss about characteristics of program media. It is simple and easy to understand. Second, it is applicable to any type of group that is children, aged, adults or differently abled. It is easy to replicate. It is planned properly before implementation. It, its recreation factor is very high. It is highly economical. And it strongly delivers the message among the group members. Now let's discuss about uses of program media. It provides individuals an opportunity to find to what extent his or her personality has to be changed to become good or socially acceptable. It improves socialization among the group members. It integrates goal and achievement of the group members it unites the members towards achieving the common goal. The other uses of program media are, it creates good relationship among the members. It helps in settlement of conflicts among people and to control their conflicts with one another. It provides recreation. It improves communication. Now let's discuss about types of program media. Interactive games, drama and mime singing, storytelling, puppet show, role play and street play. These are some of the types of program media. Now let's discuss it one by one. Interactive games. Games as program media has to the most visible and tangible results. These are simple to handle also. The use of all types of age appropriate games may be sensory, physical, intellectual or memory based including playing with blocks, toys and water can be used in the group. The second type of program media is drama or mime. In these, members of the group are asked to act various parts which has significance to their problems or difficulties. Individuals thereby gain insight into their own behavior and that of the others. The third type of program media is singing or storytelling. These are other media where the members can be encouraged to create their own stories or rhymes on given topics. So you can give the topics and they will tell the full story. They can also be given half of the story and asked to complete the rest of the story. The exercise has entertainment factor for sure. But apart from entertainment, it reveals the nature of personality of the group members. Their attitude towards the life situations will be flowing out naturally and spontaneously through the characters of the story. Let's discuss about puppet show, the another type of the program media. A puppet show as a program media can be a powerful tool for education and communication. Puppet shows can address important issues, teach life skills or raise awareness about social issues. For example, puppet shows can be used to discuss topics like bullying, mental health, diversity or conflict resolution. Puppets can make complex or sensitive subjects more approachable, especially for children and communities that may be facing challenges. This interactive and visual nature of puppet shows can engage audience and contribute to a positive social outcomes by promoting understanding, empathy and positive behavior. 
The next type of program media is role play. It is a program media tool where individuals act out scenarios to understand and practice how to handle various social situations. It is a hands on way to build confidence, empathy, problem solving abilities. By stepping into different roles, people can explore perspectives, improve their responses and gain valuable insights. The last type of the program media is street play. It involves live performances in public spaces like parks, gardens or markets, often addressing social issues or conveying a specific message. By utilizing the public spaces and combining entertainment with a social message, street plays can effectively communicate important information, challenge stereotypes and inspire collective actions. Thank you.